What about the banking sector and the risks and opportunities that it presents? Financial companies do make up almost 50% of the Australian share market and in the wake of the mining downturn, bank share prices have benefited from their robust reputation for high profits and dividends. Environmental, social and governance researchers, we'll call them ESGs, employed by fund managers are charged with analysing the opportunities and risks presented by that sector. They look at the risks and opportunities affecting the industry and also how each company manages those risks and opportunities. The real drivers of value from an industry perspective are things like maturing domestic markets, uh, technological change and regulatory change, while the factors that drive value from a company perspective are things like customer satisfaction, uh, the culture of the company, corporate governance and of course innovation. Now, risk management remains the key factor for financial institutions in generating sustainable long-term growth for its investors. And interestingly, those companies that rate more highly um, on the ESG spectrum, if you like, tend to outperform those with lower scores. This demonstrates a strong correlation between the investment performance of banks and financial companies and the way that they manage their risks and opportunities. Tracy Ferguson, thanks for listening.